Hey, Six Fivers, Bradley Wilson, your local real estate advisor, with another episode of Six Questions in Five Minutes. Today, we are interviewing a local dog trainer, an animal trainer. Stay tuned, you're gonna wanna see this. Hey, Six Fivers, thank you for watching today. Today, I'm lucky to be joined by Elizabeth Sonoda. Elizabeth, how are you doing? Great, how are you? She is the owner of Positive Vibes Animal Training here in Marietta, Georgia. And today, we're gonna learn all about her business. Thank you for having us out. Yeah, of course, thank you so much for doing that. So Elizabeth, right off the bat, how long have you been in business here in Marietta, Georgia? And what really ignited your passion for working with animals? So Positive Vibes opened in 2020. There was a lot of animals getting adopted out that year, which is amazing, but we wanted to do our part to make sure that all of those dogs found their forever homes and didn't end up going back to the shelter because of behavioral problems. Um, what ignited my passion for working with animals is from a really young age, I've always loved them. I knew I wanted to work with animals my whole life, so for the last 10 years, I've had the amazing ability to work with some really cool species from dogs to dolphins, sea lions, and penguins and apply all of the behavior knowledge that I have with them and apply it to dog training. Wow, not really sure how many dolphin owners there are in Marietta, but uh, for those of us who own regular, regular pets, what sort of services do you offer here at Positive Vibes? So Positive Vibes has a lot of different services, kind of something for everyone out there. Whether you're an experienced owner and you just need a little brushing up on a behavior, um, all the way to you have a really reactive or anxious dog, we have session packages for all of that. We also offer a board and train program, so we're able to take a dog in with us. They live here with a trainer 24 seven, and those board and train programs last anywhere from two weeks to a month, kind of depending on what the dog needs. That sounds wonderful. Really all encompassing for the pet owner. Exactly, we Excellent. want something for everyone. Very good, so we'll have a link below to her website. You can get in touch with them, see all of their services. Thinking about a little bit about real estate here, what, uh, what would you recommend or the top two things you would advise a dog owner to help get their pup acclimated to a new home? So when you move to a new home, it's a big adjustment for everyone, especially your dog. So the biggest thing would be getting them right back into their normal routine, making sure they have some type of consistency to rely on when they move to a new place is a really big number one thing to do with them. Another thing that's really great is to make a safe space for them. So get their crate, their dog bed, all of their favorite toys and put it over in a certain part of the house for them so they have a nice safe space to go decompress that. Very good. That's great advice. Thank you. <laughs> so you've had, got a couple years under your belt here in Marietta. Yes. How would you describe the dog owning community for those folks looking to move here with their dogs? How would you describe this, that dog community here in Marietta? Marietta's amazing for dogs. We absolutely love it. Marietta Square is just up the road and it has so many dog friendly shops and restaurants and just be able to go hang out in the beautiful square with them. Kennesaw Mountain is right up the road, which has amazing trails and we're really close to a bunch of streams and rivers to be able to take your dog swimming at. Excellent. These hot summers, you need some place for them to stay cool. Check Elizabeth and her team out here. Look at the link below uh, before we transition to our real estate questions. Uh, I would ask that you hit the subscribe button down below and give us a like, if you will. Elizabeth, uh, tell us and the folks out there about your most recent real estate transaction. Was it a pleasant one or was it more of a headache? Um, you know, we moved in February, so it was a really, as you know, crazy time in the market. So a lot of looking at houses, getting outbid on a couple offers. We got really lucky meeting an amazing family that had this home and we were able to close on this one, but it was kind of a longer process and felt a little defeating at times, but definitely we found the perfect place in the end. Yeah, you can tell by the surroundings, you've got a great area to run this business and uh, can accommodate a lot of pooches back here. Yes, definitely. <laughs> <laughs> That's the goal. Well, good. So the next time, it might be a while since you're kind of getting settled in here, but the next time you go to buy, sell, or even invest in real estate, what would you offer as the top two qualities you would look for in your next agent? I think the biggest qualities are honesty and their negotiation ability, obviously, in this market. Um, you want a real estate agent who's gonna be honest with you about what they think of all of the area, the pricing, all of that stuff, and somebody that's gonna be able to get the deals done for you. 
Very good, very good. Elizabeth, great to meet you. Nice to meet you. And thank you so much for having us out here today. I know your business is gonna flourish with as many dog lovers there are here. Thank you. So folks, get in touch with Elizabeth and her team at Positive Vibes Training. We'll leave a link below, as well as a link below to our site if you'd like to get in touch with us and we can help you buy, sell, or invest in real estate. I'm Bradley Wilson, your local real estate advisor. Thank you for watching.